Yellowstone Volcano USGS Scientists' Warning of Major Earthquake Revealed Yellowstone Volcano is under threat from an earthquake dubbed a megaquake by a USGS scientist giving a lecture on supervolcanoes. Yellowstone Volcano is located between the states of Wyoming, Montana and Idaho, within Yellowstone National Park in the U.S. The caldera is labeled a supervolcano because of its potential to cause destruction on a global scale. The mountain last experienced a supereruption around 630,000 years ago, but there has been a lot of minor activity since then. Volcanoes usually erupt when molten rock, also known as magma, rises to the surface after the Earth's mantle melts. This usually occurs when tectonic plates pull apart or when one plate is pushed beneath another plate. However, super eruptions are known to occur after large earthquakes that trigger riots at nearby volcanoes. Jacob Lowenstein, the leading scientist in charge of monitoring Yellowstone, revealed in his lecture in Menlo Park, California, how this has happened before and threatens to happen again if an earthquake exceeds 6 on the Richter scale. He said in 2014, many earthquakes have occurred in Yellowstone over the last 25 years, just a representative example. You will see many earthquakes near Lake Hebgen. That's probably because it's close to the site of a 7.5 magnitude earthquake that occurred in 1959. There are occasional big ones, and there may be one in the Yellowstone area every 100 to 300 or 400 years. Dr. Lowenstein went on to reveal how earthquake activity should be monitored because of the threat it poses. He added, the last major disaster occurred in 1959 and caused a major landslide, killing around 20 people. This is a geological hazard that is more common in the region than volcanic eruptions. People living in the area should already know about it. But this is not the first warning the scientist has given. He previously warned of the dangers of pressure cookers that could be catastrophic, referring to hydrothermal explosions. This occurs when superheated water trapped beneath the surface changes rapidly from liquid to vapor. Boiling water, steam, mud and rock fragments called breccia are ejected over an area several meters to several kilometers in diameter. Dr. Lowenstein said, There have been many events like this in the last 15,000 years in Yellowstone. The largest forms Mary Bay on Yellowstone Lake and is two miles wide. So if you think about the way geothermal systems are built, the boiling temperature of water at the surface is 100 C. In Yellowstone, you're at a higher altitude and the temperature is around 92 C, but as you descend, the pressure increases and the boiling temperature also increases, like a pressure cooker.